Today, a new rule would change how paid parental leave is given to school employees that will be considered by state school leaders. WRO's Kelsey Coffey is live outside the State Board of Education in Raleigh this morning. And Kelsey, this would expand to include leave for miscarriages and stillbirths. Renee, this new rule would go into effect next school year if the board chooses to move forward with this this morning. State school leaders will meet here at the Board of Education in Raleigh just to have a discussion about this. We're not expecting a vote until later. A temporary rule is already in place right now. Public school employees receive two months of paid parental leave after having a baby. The final rule that's up for discussion today adds more guidelines, including addressing leave for miscarriages and stillbirths. Employees would receive a month off for a miscarriage after 12 weeks and two months off for a stillbirth. This rule would apply to both parents, so we'll keep you posted on when the board uh, chooses to move forward with the vote. And today's meeting is scheduled for this morning at 10 o'clock. Kelsey Coffey, WRL News, live in Raleigh.